Hey, what's up? I'm Remy Warren, and I'm gonna be sharing one of my favorite ways to prepare a wild game backstrap. The first step is going to start out in the field harvesting your favorite wild meat. I'll be using elk, but pronghorn, whitetail, mule deer, honestly, any big game meat will do. For elk, we'll start with one third of a backstrap. For deer or similar, do half the backstrap. We're going to season the steak with a blended mixture of fresh rosemary, garlic, olive oil, salt, and pepper. To do this, you'll need a food processor or some sort of blender. Now let's make the marinade. Start by stripping three sprigs of rosemary and peeling a head of garlic. This will be added into the food processor with a quarter cup of olive oil. You will now liberally coat both sides of the steak with garlic rosemary combo and season with some salt and pepper. Make sure to reserve a little bit of the mixture to top the steak with before putting in the oven. Once coated, you will cover the meat and place it in the fridge for an hour or more to marinate. The next step is going to be browning the steak on all sides with a really hot skillet. You want it to get a nice sear hot and fast before putting it in a 450 degree oven. We want to cook the meat to an internal temperature of 125 degrees. The cook time can go quick depending on the size of the steak, so make sure to keep an eye on it. 5 to 10 minutes may be all that it needs. As a final step, remove the meat from the oven and let it rest for 5 to 10 minutes, tented under aluminum foil. This helps keep the juices in the steak. Then slice and serve. That's good. Mm. Prime rib style elk backstrap. I don't think it gets any better than this.